Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got some exciting news for all you Arch Linux fans out there. Especially if you're into Cache OS. The Cache OS team just dropped their August 2024 release, and it's packed with some really cool features, including the much anticipated Cosmic desktop environment and NVIDIA's Open GPU kernel modules. So, let's dive into what's new in this release and why you might want to check it out. Alright, so for those of you who might not be familiar, Cache OS is a rolling release distro based on Arch Linux. It's a great choice whether you're new to Arch or a seasoned user. Cache OS offers a streamlined experience while still giving you all the flexibility and control that Arch is known for. Now, this August 2024 release comes just a few months after their big June update, and it's clear that the developers have been hard at work to bring us some really exciting updates. So, what's new in this release? Let's start with the basics. This update comes with the Linux kernel 6.10.5 Cachios and KDE Plasma 6.14 as the desktop environment for the flagship desktop edition. Graphics-wise, they've upgraded to Mesa 24.2.0, which should give you a smoother experience, especially if you're into gaming or heavy graphical tasks. Now, one of the standout features in this release is the inclusion of NVIDIA's Open GPU kernel modules. This is huge news for anyone using NVIDIA GPUs, especially if you've got one of the newer 20 USX series or later models. Cache OS will now automatically detect your hardware and use these open source modules by default. And to make things even better, they've set the beta version of the NVIDIA 560 driver as the default after extensive testing. Plus, the kernel manager has been updated to support the building of these NVIDIA open modules. So, if you're a gamer or someone who relies on NVIDIA hardware, this release should make your life a lot easier. Next up, let's talk about the Cosmic Desktop environment. If you've been following the latest trends in the Linux world, you've probably heard about Cosmic. It's a new desktop environment developed by System76 for their Pop OS distro, and it's known for its insane customization options and modern design. In this Cache OS release, they've included the alpha version of Cosmic. Now, it's worth noting that Cosmic is still in its early stages, so it might not be perfect just yet. In fact, when I tried it out in a virtual machine, it installed fine, but didn't play nice after rebooting, I ended up with a black screen. So, if you're going to try out Cosmic, I recommend doing it on bare metal rather than in a VM. If you're an existing Cache OS user and you want to try out Cosmic, you can install it by running the command sudo pacman s cosmic session. This will give you the base packages along with some Rust-based Cosmic apps like Cosmic Store, Cosmic Text, and Cosmic Terminal. Another significant upgrade in this release is the improved infrastructure. Cache OS now has a new sponsor, CDN77, who's providing them with a global cache CDN. This is set to improve connection speeds for users all over the world, which is always a plus. They've also added a cache CDN mirror alongside the Arch Linux mirror during installation. Mirror ranking has been tweaked too, so now you'll get up-to-date mirrors leading to quicker package installations. And in case your primary mirrors fail, there are fallback options hosted by Cache OS and a Tier 1 mirror from Arch Linux. To wrap things up, there are a few other notable changes in this release. The Libex test library has been replaced with Libay, which should improve compatibility and performance. The Cache Crute tool now supports LUX encryption, which is great for anyone looking to add an extra layer of security. The handheld edition of Cache OS now supports the ROG Ally X, and they've also improved secure boot support with a new script and a detailed wiki page. Lastly, hardware detection has seen some fixes, especially with prime hybrid profile detection so you should see better performance on hybrid GPU systems. So, there you have it, the Cache OS August 2024 release. With NVIDIA's open GPU kernel modules, the alpha version of Cosmic, and some solid infrastructure upgrades, this release is definitely worth checking out. Whether you're already a Cache OS user or you're thinking about giving it a try, there's never been a better time to jump in. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Linux content. And as always, I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Have you tried out the new Cache OS release? What do you think of Cosmic so far? Let me know. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.